Welcome to the Buzz Show, your number one sports online show. It is what it is, Kamakawa Kama Ibada. Welcome again. Remember, we always request you to subscribe, keep on sharing our content, Ili Tuzidi Kugro together. Now, football or any other sports in Itaji, Vitumob Sana, Ikiwemo, players, coaches, na peer fans and most of the time fans play a very big role in uh, growing our game besides our fans supporting teams and uh, giving our players moral support they have a life they live na hile obasi niko hapa na fred by shoes jamaa mbaya tunamjua he is a very strange uh, football fan nataka kushare na yeye story kidogo aweze kutuambia kuhusu life yake passion yake in football uh, na vile vile akona ka biashara najua amejenga wase wengi hapo nyuma kwa hivyo usicheze mbali eh, bro ni aje fiti fiti mosh karibu the buzz asante sana ume subscribe mapema mapema sana <laughs> sana opportunity na shukuru ya kunipa tuweze kuongea mambo mob na i hope atalano leo tunatusikiza na tutasaidiana zaidi after hapa pia True. So uh, Fred, me nimekujua kwa vitu mob. Lakini unajua hii this is a sports channel. So tutaanzia hapo tu kwa ball. Umecheza ball? Honestly sijaicheza ball mimi. But uh passion ile nilikuwa nayo in the recent past, maybe for the last maybe 7 or 8 years. Eh uh, imenipush kupenda ball sana. Najaribu kulearn vitu mbili tatu out of it. But uh, mini serious fan wa ball. Fans wengi wa ball au jungle cheza ball apparently. Ni mdomo tunapiga gatu huku nje. <laughs> Lakini kucheza kucheza. Ai. Ngumu, ngumu. Lakini ile kidogo ile nini? Ile ya mtaa. Najaribu jaribu, najaribu jaribu. Sistako Sharinyo DJ alikuwa mchezaji mzuri sana wa wa ball. Yeye talent alitoa wapi? Eh sisi yangu ni msewabidi sana bidi ye chenye nataka kufanya nafanya gana ro moja eh passion ya bola i think alitoa pale tu mtao kongo kulikuwa na mademo leo alikuwa mabishi zake wengi walikuwa ni za bol so yeye alikuwa laki kuianza mapema na hivyo tu akaendelea 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 akajipata mahali excuse hiyo bol ndio imemfikia place yuko anakulia you thank god but passion ilitoka tu kwa mtaa eh yeye alafu kuna sisi yangu pia mwingine mbiga anaitwa Lili pia yeye pia alikuwa footballer kidogo but aliacha 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 nisha hapo katikati sijui shida ilikuwa gani ah. so sharinyo tumesikia ball imekupeleka far cheza 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 kiwewe size ni excel <laughs> <laughs> lazima tufanye usangwenya kidogo so bro passion yako ya football imekuja kwanza hebu tuambie una support team gani hapa nchini Kenya hapa Kenya sana sana Uh, by default mimi ni fan wa gore sana mm-hmm. sana but since napenda football support yangu inaenda kwa hiyo inaenda kwa timu yote ina 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 ina, 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 ina cheza ball fit na timu yote yenye management yake ina, ina ikawa wachezaji wake vizuri support yangu nawapea vizuri sana mm-hmm. sababu ni rea sana saa hii na economy ya Kenya kupata timu ile na shughulikia wachezaji wake vizuri So I think tukianza support tutoka hapo yenye team yenye na support wachezaji wake vizuri tuipatie support pia hizo timu zingine zitakuja kulearn cuz ball si mimi niende nijibambe na yule msi anacheza ball pale chini uh, atakuja anze kunitisha tena huu hebu nisaidie na so nirudi home while mimi nimejibamba na sifikirie si ana nini ana ana filaja after kuni kudibambisha nikaenda grao so but uh, acha niseme mimi ni fan galo sana sana. Najua wengineo wenyewe wananiona gana majizi zingine, but hizo majizi zingine ni si usangwenya. Ni mabeshti zangu sana, <laughs> ni mabeshti zangu wana mabeshti zangu wengi wako kwa management ya football. So ile msana anakuambia Fredi kujuchukue jezi ndio hii, pia si va jezi yetu. So hizi kata sababu mimi ni mkenya this is a, in, 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 in ya Kenya lakini hiyo nikipewa jezi ya team fulani na cheza against gore, rest assured nitavaa gore kwanza ikicheza mkiwashinda alafu ndio nitakuja ku ndawa consider ni kitu ni kitu kipi moja unaweza sema niko proud of this kwa 
hiyo timu yenu ya Gor Mahia Gor kuna vitu mob sana kwa za kwa proud of uh, apart from management watu wanasemaga sana siwezi sema ile kitu sijui but uh, mob ikisemwa jua iko ndivyo tu sitakanga kuji involve sana sababu iko beyond mimi mimi yangu ni kwenda ground and ni support team sasa ile inacheza but uh, kitu ile na nime proud about uh, gor ni achievement zake despite hizo mambo mingi zinapitia unaweza notice kuna wachezaji bado hazitoka gor wataenda wakienda huko kafu na wengine wanalalala chini ya bench mahali saa sa zingine ma highlights kidogo lakini utapata bado hawezi toka tu pale si unajua kuna wachezaji bado kutu pale gor atakwambia oh, atulipu sijui nini nini lakini yeye yeah, anajua tu analipwa hizi zingine atulipwi ni za huku zingine za ku za kupea tu pressure but naweza kuwa proud that uh, we have achieved uh, so much uh, uki, ukiangalia na vile football ya Kenya na RAM achievement ya god iko iko ime struggle lakini wako mahali alafu niambie kitu moja yenye gor ishawefanyika pale gor ukaibika yani uka feel ai yani kitu naweza tufanyikia sisi ukaboeka tu sana ili kwa kwa igrao ili kwa mwaka gani hiyo hata <laughs> sakumbuka ile thika story thika eh hiyo <laughs> niliona baba wanalia hapa mimi bado nilikuwa bado i think ndo nilikuwa nimemaliza madha shule hapo hiyo time eh ah, ilikuwa embarrassing ndo nilikuwa naanza kuwa fan wa ball sasa mm. i think uh, football hata make emotion sana vile inafaa mm. sababu kama unapenda kitu ukilose ukilia inamaanisha uliko napenda hiyo staff sana. Hiyo mm. ndio ilikuwa maybe the lowest moment zangu na na, na, na team. Hizi zingine za labda tujashinda ligi on a normal circumstance apart from here Athika yenye tulikuwa ilikuwa imekaa after very long time ilikuwa ni ile unataka kupata. Hizo zingine za kawaida. Hizo zingine zenye oh task hasa zingine nimepata sijui akina nayo mpata. Hiyo ni hiyo ni kawaida. Mmecheza lakini mkuu manage. Hiyo ilikuwa manageable but ile Athika ilikuwa hatari ilikuwa hatari. Na wewe kama fan wa football kuna family ambayo tulikuja tukakuwa nayo inaitwa wadau. Mm-hmm. Unaweza semaje kuhusu hii family? Yaani ni nini mtu anaweza jivunia kwa fan wa football wa Kenya through that family ya wadau? Um, through family ya wadau watu wako pale na interest tofauti. Watu wako na interest tofauti. Wengine wanataka kunetwa, wengine wanataka kujijenga. Uh, financially wengine pia wako pale tu sababu hiyo ni place watu wako like minded wako but uh, pia iko na masaidi shows zake zingine zenye sitaki ku mention hapa zile mtu anapatana na mtu kuna kwa na makesi baadaye maskandol su mingi zenye pia zina spice up hiyo nini zina spice up uh, the whole wadau uh, staff Uh, siko so much into 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 it sana sababu when i thought nilikuwa nataka kunini kuingia sana jeke ndani vizuri ni participate so much into it vitu mob zile happen kwa life yangu mpaka zika ni derail lakini sasa ndio ina come kuna vitu mob zinafanyika na wadau kama recently ya, ya kulundengi ilifanyika ili kwa initiative poa when uh, watu wanacheza scandals zinatokea pia mbili tatu and then wanaenda hapo wamesaidia situation kama ile utuoma ni nilikuwa proud ni vitu sikuwa najua sana za pigia nani simu nimwambie eh hey boss mlifanya job poa mm. but najua ulikuwa one of them nini shati nilikuwa one of them mimi ndio chairman wa hiyo committee sasa sikuwa chairman kwa one of them acha <laughs> kwa mjaluo sana una kubrag sana sawa mr chairman mlifanya job poa sana mm. Mm. mlifanya job poa sana story ya ya huyo nani uh, mchezaji mm na wife yake kama one of the uh, wadau wenye wako kwa nini kwa hiyo group ya wadau mlifanya hiyo poa sana so Tuki, hapo hapo hapo, hapo, mm. hapo kwa kwa hiyo committee mm. ni vizuri pia tutaje wale wase wako hapo kwa hiyo committee so that tunaza wa big up mm-hmm. kuna Steven Ochola former mm-hmm. ulinzi mm-hmm. kuna James Tuma wa Kefwa kuna mm-hmm. Bob Junior ambaye ni CEO wa Kulundeng mm-hmm. kuna Ochiweida na kuna Kiari Mbugwa nisha nisha meet nao wote isipokuwa nani isipokuwa situma ndo tujeka atujie onge one on one ana faida huyo hata usipokutana naye ana faida uh, faida kama ana faida kwako mimi ndamtafuta ni kama kama ana faida kwangu hiyo ndakuja kuprove mimi mwenyewe anaweza baiki hatu 
faida yangu tu inakuga tu ndogo ndogo tukisonga lakini akina bob bob ni msempoa sana uh, kiarie tuna tunamjua ni msesa zingine pia kianza kupasha pia atakupasha tu vizuri but mse ana ana time ya kumins words zake the whole team nafanya job poa ni wasi nishaka nisha na nyinyi nikajua the match you can do na ile pia mwezi fanya pia Mungu anajua itafanyika sangapi kama ni kitu poa but kama ni mbaya msijaribu mm. hapo hapo tu uli, uli trend i think it was kitwani or something hivi uli trend sana kwa sababu ya what happened to you mm-hmm. and uh, we are really sorry for that and uh, we are glad that um, tumeona ume overcome mm-hmm. you've been very strong umekuwa na mtoi maybe ningekuwa ni, ningetaka sana uweze kushare na watu kidogo what really happened because this is something that you know it's nature this is something that ha- can happen to someone else mm-hmm. or it has happened before mm-hmm. how can someone overcome a very strong venye tumekuona tumekuona ukitonyesha mtu hivi venye grow you know mm-hmm. to some of us it's really encouraging unajua tulikuwa tuna expect kupeleke down kabisa mm-hmm. so maybe share at least kidogo tu wajue what exactly happened uli manageaje one uh, si, 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 si kitambo sana mm-hmm. but na kusoma kitu kingine hapa yenye ni kwa ni post leo the don't respond to Inasema God uh, appendi to kidwell in the past but anataka to uh, to focus on the present na to walk behind yeye yeah, yeah, to the future as in as we tukikumbuka tu kidogo about the past ina to shape pia but to walk behind God uh, towards the future prosperity lazima itakuwa encouragement lazima itakuwa na ndio kitu imekuwa kini push mambo zilikuwa mob mob sana sije mention kitu but when uh, wife yangu ali ali pass because you know story i think kuna nini unauliza your time nilikuwa na trend wife aki pass mambo zilitokea mingi watu walikuwa wamesema oh freedom mingi illuminati ndio uh, nini biz sije ndio ingia siasa watu walikuwa nafikiria nda kusimama <coughs> na history tio kuza viatu so tuza viatu simame sangapi mm. although kuna nani amo na uza alikuwa anaza tu viatu kusa alisimama siku zindo mpya stare mm pia mimi simbaya lakini hiyo notion hata alikuwa anakuja sema wewe nimeingia illuminati illuminati na bado niko kongo kuni illuminati yangu inakuwa imesota aja mm. ilikuwa ilikuwa na pressure mob that was you mean me sin sana kushinda wasi wengine mpaka tuna mention watu wengine mpaka unajua ni mimi wanaongelea mimi eh, chali ya purity ama ni fred mwingine mm. mambo zilikuwa mob but uh, wala sio alikuwa minister around family yangu na friends wale 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 genuine friends walikuwa na make sure sisiki hizo vitu zinasemekana huko nje and that uh, na focus so much on uh, mtu hivi nyata nini ata grow na vinye nitali wife to rest at your time because hiyo time tu wife alikufa ilikuwa tu 3 weeks before tu ende kumzika but story lisemekana i think story ile sema kana mingi sana mtaye tu watu wako na lot of time wakongo watu wako na lot of time wana wana kujua kushinda venye hata unajijua sasa zingine tutajiuliza eh hey, i think mnaongea juu ya msemi mwingine mtakwambia ni wewe au ah, unamwambia tu ni sawa basi kama ni mimi basi ni sawa juu sasa kama unajua siwezi kuconvince siwezi kuconvince otherwise kama ushajua ni vile kuko but watu wako na pia yeah, a way of uh, God and our king through mysterious ways. Hakuna kitu why happen bila sababu. Maybe it happened not to dead wengine na dead na mtu anaisha tu hivyo. Story yake inaisha kabisa. But nilikuwa nimesema hii wife yangu haitaisha hivyo. Haitaisha hivyo. Ata pass tu venye wasi wengine wanakufa na wanazikwa na wanasaulika. Yeah, yeah pia atasaulika at some point because uh, we don't want dwell in the past sana but uh, nilitumia opportunity to encourage watu pale nje that uh, hakuna setback ile inaweza kushinda hakuna setback ile inaweza kushinda at first nilikuwa nashindwa mpaka nilikuwa na ma, dawa zingine nilikuwa ganazo nilikuwa ga epileptic kitambo but ilikuja kapona nilikuwa nazo kwa hao zile zishafika mpaka expire nilikuwa nilikuwa nimesema nikitoa kuzika wife kitu ilikuwa na maibu mbeza hizo dawa tu dead pia wewe watu wa nini ndio acha wache kuongea nikakumbuka kumbe ata ata Raila naongelewaga tu lakini bado yuko tu uh, 70 years on ama 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 mse mwingine tu pia naongelewaga tu lakini anaishi tu 
So nika focus on wala siwa na get encouragement kutoka kwa situation yenye niko nayo. Na hivyo ndo tukawa mtu huyu yuko sasa hivi tuko tuna tuko almost 2 two months 18 2 years i mean tuna clock 18 months i think in december because it happened last year mwezi wa sita so 18 months si mbaya sana uh, si kidogo sana tukiangalia na grace ya god venye ame ametushughulikia si kidogo of course support imekuwa ikikam hata kwa wadau wenyewe wengine labda walikuwa wananijua that's why aku nini aku akuweza show up sasa nilikuwa in need but rest assured so hizi bila mwenye ku show up sasa alikuwa wale 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 show up walikuwa good enough wale walikuwa wale show up walikuwa good enough wewe siwezi bila msi ati oh atasa mtu akichakata kuchangishiwa maybe namwambia oh huku kama time yangu hiyo ni hiyo ni nonsense mimi mwambie msi kama ku come maybe either kujua ama akukua na do your time juu sasa hii Kenya mambo zimekuwa mingi sana But wale wale kama waliokilisha kila mtu mwenye alikuwa ananiona ni trend pale nje for good or bad reasons but na believe ilikuwa reasons poor because messages zile za kuonyesha nikikuonyesha tu maybe after show watu wana watu wanakuwa encouraged sana na maybe posts zangu zenye na make them toy na venye tuna carry life on past uh, death ya nini ya, mam, ya mamake ni grace ya god na support ya ya kila mtu mwenye ame take part into it. Uh. So uh, all we can say is that we really encourage you be a strong man. Na umekuanga strong na god always has a reason for for everything. Mm-hmm. And uh, before we talk about your your business, wewe huimba. Mm-hmm. Take us through your spiritual life. Nilianza kuimba hapa St Stephen's uh, Cathedral hapa Jogoro nikiwa class 8. Uh, Family yetu imekuwa tu ya music. Mbako Sharon mbona anacheza ball pia alikuwa naimbaga. Alto. Alikuwa naimba alto. Sisi zangu tu mmoja ndiye alikuwa naimba soprano Lizzie mwenye akona Sharon huko kwingine. Uh. But uh, sisi zangu mwingine and Walili. Eh hey, alto hata nikisema tuna tunaenda kuimba mahali hatuna quorum. Mm. Yeye akiwa tu peke yake ana za balance watu kama 40. Yeye mm. ndo but budangu pia alikuwa ga mwalimu wa kwaya nini cha chingine inaitwa uh, inaitwa hera watu wanitanga jo hera man, but uh, cha chingine inaitwa church of christ in africa cca hapo ndo tulianza kujua kwaya but ndo tukuje kuimba sasa hapa nini hapa uh, st stevens mzee alikuwa alikuwa against it sana mm. uh, sababu alikuwa anataka tu stick uh, tu nini yechache yake but uh, believe you me mimi vinyo nilienda mimi nilikuwa kwanza kuja hiyo kwa haya master zangu akuja aka join hatakuwa hata anglican sisi but tukaenda saa hii after saa zingine mnaenda kuimba mnaenda kuimba mali mna delete eh tulikuwa na lalata nje ya ukweli tulikuwa na lala nje mdano anaambia mrudi pale mmetoka tunaambia tumetoka cha churudi ni huko tunalala nje vizuri mpaka asubuhi kutoka job ndo tunaingia but uh, out of uh, hizo tribulations zote i do believe madangu alikuja katoka ile chacha kataka to join huku budangu sikuzi ana appreciate so much what church imekuwa ikitufanyia za family uh, hata sio ati kunini hata sio hata ku on a spiritual basis hata wamekuwa kitusaidia uh, nikiwa shule kulikuwa na pastor flani the late ndungu alikuwa anatusaidia sana familia yetu but uh, spiritually nimekuwa built sana sana na kwaya mm. sana sana na kwaya ndo imekuwa imekuwa ikinijenga of course tunimba kwaya zingine huko nje uh, wengine wenyewe wamekuwa kiona ma videos tumekuwa uh, status kwa na reveal uh, videos zake sana ama ma picha zake sikuwa na reveal but tunaimba huko status na kina Musjo akawa adau na members wengine uh, tunaimba DCI pia tunaimba huko but uh, DCI ni kama kazi kidogo ni kama pia uh, former uh, director general alitupatia no director general uh, director kinote alitupatia opportunity ya kukuja ku showcase talent yetu tuna tuna nini tuna benefit out of it because pia kuna zile vitu tuna gain at the end of every month na hii kuimba tu na, na hii kuimba tu ilianza tu church mm. Personally nimewaona mkimba kama family. Unajua mimi najua kwenu, najua wazazi wako, najua sijui kama unajua. 
Najua. Najua. Hapo kwa wazazi ndio sijui. Na naona tujua sisi sisi wengine wenye tumebaki kwa ground lakini hivi wazazi sasa kama najua kwenu nitakosaje kujua wazazi wangu? Aya kujua kwetu labda umen surprise. Na nashukuru. So kumbuki tukiwa kwenu au matanga des. Eh nakumbuka. Ni vinye hiyo time si kuwa keen sana on wadau. But wadau wali play a very big role back then. Eh wadau wali nini asijui mbona zia mention. Hiyo time kama si wadau mabeshti za Sharon cuz Sharon alikuwa so close huko sisi tulikuwa tumeshikilia chachi pande nyingine. Wadau wali play a very big role. I think Sharon na Jaisa hiyo story. Tulikuwa eh wadau Uh, walicheza very big role kama si nyinyi i think tungekuwa bado tunalia mpaka leo ningekuwa tunalia mpaka leo kwa hiyo mtu wetu alikuwa msiku for like 13 years yes. akuwa anaongea yes. uh. but um, li baba yo baden na sisi rest in peace death rest in peace purity now bro wewe ni mse unapiga mboka mboka ya viatu you know pia ni vizuri sisi tuna tuna promote biz mse anafanya Mm-hmm. So nataka tu tuambie kuhusu bizi yako unauza nini unapatikana wapi kama unafanya deliveries nini as in sasa promote biz eh, kwa majina zingine apart from kuitwa Freddy ama Baba Ivan anaitwa buy shoes sana sana ndoto anajua nao kwa mtaa ndio nimejaribu kufanya fanya pia branding yangu ndogo anauza menswear mostly but ladies ta, ladies are tuzi shindo kupia kutafuta mitu zao Menswe online sana sana ndo niko visible sana sababu place shop iko watu wengi wanasemaga oh ni far but watu wako comfortable na kuuza ku buy vitu online nowadays cuz ya trustile tumejaribu ku, kuweka watu wengi wengine wanauzia viatu like 70% wengi wao tujaona na hivi nile tu confidence ile sana nani watu wanakupea wanywa shaba hivi watu before wanakupea wana those endorsement mse mwingine anasema mse yako trustworthy via wacha tu niniacha tu buy viatu kwake but mostly na deal na men's official na casual vitu zangu ni fit maybe show ikiendelea unaweza kuona scroll natumia tu majina zangu IG naitwa Fred Kodhambo HSC but then in head of state comment CG hiyo sijasema kwa nini alafu na uh, Facebook natumia Fred Kodhambo were Instagram Fred Kodhambo Fred Kandasko Odhambo underscore, underscore HSC ukundu utanipata Facebook I think it'll turn into page uh, juzi so Fred kwa jambo wewe ukinipata huko utaona utaniona na mtoi shangae ni page ya biz na ni page ya family cause ya trust lend ya kubil na watu unajua uki sell tu vitu online and then watu waone face behind kitu kutrustika ni ngumu mm. so tunaeka tu cause clients wangu ni ndio wamekuja wame kwa friends Fre, f, clients wangu wamekuja kwa friends friends ndio wameshindwa kukuwa clients but wengine pia wanajaribu wengine wanajaribu so huko uh, ukipata na mtu hii pia ni kuonyesha tu that support yako ya kubai viatu inatupeleka poa mimi na mtu huyu wangu uh, that's you utatupata utatu, utatu, utatu pia pale so, and then pia ndo ndo ni pia wateja wangu pia personal attention sitaki kufungua page ile msaita mtu za kiatu saa hii alafu niko hii page nyingine sijamjibu na mjibu yeah. tu hours later so afadhal tu niko tu na page moja yenye naweza fanya biz na ni naweza pia kwa tu visible pale kwa social media. Mm. Wadau 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 mazee tu support Fred kwa bizi yake mnajua viatu zake zinakuanga noma. Kuanga noma ukivaa tu unasikia raha. So bro because of uh, time ningependa uweze kutupea parting shot yako yenye maybe something you want to share with us. Mm. Sija mention that hata niko na team. Ya nini? ya yeah, ya yeah, but they, you, watu wanafikiria ni joke <laughs> but team iko pale nje uh, wachezaji wamekuwa na, na very hard time msi yako na passion ya ball but uh, saa zingine anatakwenda kucheza tonama mahali ana facilitation mimi nitafuta tu kwa mabishi zangu hapa niambi kuna kuna team niko nayo hapa sasa so, ndakwenda kucheza ball nitumie thao tatu nimepata tafa ya ende team yenyewe ndio hii inaitwa hapa by shoes fc sababu nimejaribu ku maintain hiyo brand moja but parting shot uh, kama ninasema what i can say is that uh, challenges zinaweza kuwa uh, since ni 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 share sports na peer real life experience challenges zinaweza kuwa if i could just mention wachezaji wamekuwa na challenges so much wengi wao nakujaga mpaka tunaongea mtu ana ana hata vinyata kula labda usiku and then msewe labda unaona pale 
msana na kuambia mimi hata nataka commit suicide mwingine anataka kuachana na ball but challenges zuko challenges as usual last forever tumia challenges zako kama opportunity ya kukupush forward mimi sikukuaga hivi before wife yangu nini hapa sio naweza sema for for, for, for real sikuaga hivi vinywa sana niona sasa hii challenge ilikam wife akapasa kanacha na mtu hii do you believe your challenge ndio ile ni push mpaka sasa yote anaweza kuniona after you could trend imenisaidia biz imefanya hata uko nje wasio wamejua Fredia na Imbaga kwa hiyo time when wife ali nini kwa na post a lot of videos za kuimba nini ikaniweka pale nje watu wakakuja kuniona so challenges ikiwa try uh, use it as an opportunity kusonga na pray god pia aise kukunini kukupea strength ya ku overcome challenges kama hizo as uh, zina come mm. Thank you so much Freddy and thank you for sharing your story with us. Mzee tuna appreciate sana. Tutazidi kuku support and uh, my director hapo kwa buy shoes itabidi cheze kama wewe weka ma graphics hapo, peana namba hapo. Majamaa wanunue viatu ili vana pate maziwa. Sina la ziada mzee Oliver Nanda is the master director super. <laughs> Yuko pale ametulia tu anatuambia saa mbaya na sisi hatuna la ziada ila kusema big up mzee keep on subscribing. Thank you so much.